I'm gonna make some very simple, delicious pecan toffee. First thing you wanna do is line a jelly roll pan or a 15 by 10 inch pan with aluminum foil and spray it with some uh, cooking spray. I'm gonna take a cup of pecans and sort of spread them around this pan and take some butter and a cup of sugar and about a third cup of water. I'm gonna mix these together. I'm gonna bring this up to temperature of 310 degrees, which is a hard candy stage. Now once your butter and your sugar and your water are in the pan, you wanna be sure you're stirring constantly. Sometimes sugar has the tendency to sort of clump and stick. As the pan gets hot, some parts of that can kind of start to caramelize a little too soon. If you don't, constantly keep them agitated and moving back towards the center. Now as far as stirring your caramel, I like to use a wooden spoon, but you can also use a heat resistant uh, rubber spatula as well. Works just as good, but there's something, uh, I don't know, it's very traditional about a wooden spoon. Keep stirring, but you're waiting on that 310 degree mark. Very important to pay attention to this thermometer because it is basically going to let you know the different levels of the crack. The crack is in when you are going to be busting this up at the end and breaking off these great pieces of toffee. I'm starting to get that really familiar, almost like a nutty smell to it. When that caramel and butter begins to uh, come together, begins to brown, and I'm going to pour our caramel over my pecans right here on the pan. And now while this is super hot, it's important you kind of bring your chocolate into the picture. Now at this point, we want our toffee to chill for about 30 minutes. After that 30 minute period, it's gonna be ready to go. We can take our uh, mallet or a rolling pin and break it into uh, large or small pieces, whatever you prefer. So our pecan toffee is set now. It's uh, ready to be broken up. Now when you go to break it, there's, there's no real rhyme or reason to it. You just wanna start breaking it up into nice big chunks. Now one of the best things about toffee is that it keeps really well. You can store this in an airtight container for up to a week or more. It's uh, great to give as gifts because you can wrap it up in some really uh, nice paper, put it in a great little box for uh, a gift for Christmas, a birthday. Super simple to make and delicious.